Hey guys, I know it's been a long, long time, um, but I've just been busy, um, so I guess I'll tell you what's been going on, um, let's see, the last time I talked to you was the midterm, so, did really good on that, <coughs> had to, uh, now we had to sign up for paramedic ride-alongs and, uh, hospital time, and my paramedic ride-along was on the 24th? Uh, but we went well. It was really boring. Um, we only had one transfer in the morning and then the rest of the day. That was at like 9 and I stayed till about 8.30 p.m. and we had nothing. We literally watched movies. So, uh, it was fun, but I mean, no, you know, I was hoping for more. Then this last weekend on the 1st, we, uh, I, um, signed up to do a bike race. Um, not like a racing, um, bicycle race, and I was EMT staff for it, so people went down, <coughs> I cleaned off the road rash and everything, and we got some pretty good ones, so, um, that was a lot of fun, the next week, on the 7th, yeah, yeah, the Saturday, on the 7th, I do my hospital time, so we'll see how that goes, hopefully it goes pretty well, um, I had a bunch of computer issues, I don't know if I told you about that in the last video, but I literally placed everything except for the DVD drive, uh, or the DVD-ROM. New hard drive, new CPU, new fan, new motherboard. Uh, I beefed up my video card to a GeForce 8800 GSX, GXS, something like that. Not the top one, but the one right below it. Um, so, for all you can computer, like, guys, that's pretty much the top of the line, like, there's only one of the same model that's higher than it out right now, and, um, so, my spring break is finally here, I know a lot of people have already had their spring breaks, mine didn't start till April 2nd, so I'm on my second day of spring break, now, everybody is like, all right, spring break, I get to go party and everything. Do you know what me to me? I finally get to go back to the gym. Um, yesterday I went, uh, did back and tries because my back's been bothering me, but I know what fixes it. Uh, it's just working out. For some reason, uh, if, a lot, if any of you guys have back problems, just try working it out. My dad uh, also has back problems. Or, I shouldn't say back problems, back pain. And, uh, same thing with him. Whenever he starts working out, you know, after about a week or so, after, I'd say after about three rounds, because you know how you have to do back and, uh, back and drives, then legs, and blah, blah, blah. You know what I mean? After about three rounds, pain's completely gone. So, um, you know, if any of you people have back pain, just give it a shot. So, uh, what do you have to lose? I mean, a couple hours. So, today I kind of kick myself. I normally wake up before work and go to the gym because I hate going after like five or so because the place is packed. I hate, it's it's not that I hate being around people, it's that I hate having to like wait for like him to get off the machine or alter my workout because that one's not available or, you know, I I progress every set, so like if, I, if I'm doing dumbbells, I go 20, 25, 30, 35. I hate having to go like two sets of 25 because I don't want to lose my, you know, lose the momentum, but he's got the 30s and I need to go up, but he has them, so I can't. So I like to go before I go to work, which typically means that I'm at the gym at either 2.15 or 3.15, depending on the day. Um, but, uh, so this morning, I kind of woke up, and I was just like, I'm, I can't do this, and uh, just went back to sleep, so I kicked myself, and I was like, you know what, if I didn't wake up for my um, weight workout, which I actually love, I said, fine, you know, I hate running, so I said, and, and in all honesty, I'm a little shy, so I really punished myself, and I said, you know what, you're not going to be able to go to the gym and run on the electricals, you're going to have to go run in public, so... You know, it's all about, um, you know, uh, keeping yourself in line, I guess. And so I, um, uh, you know, went out and ran for 45 minutes. I shouldn't say ran. Ran and, um, 
ran and walked and ran and walked because I'll tell you what guys elliptical and treadmill are not the same as running out on the street uh, for at least for me uh, for some reason like I can run on ellipticals uh, at level 10 speed and believe me that's different on every machine I, I realized that real quickly but you know I can run on that for 30 minutes barely break a sweat man I could barely run down my long street I can't say just my down my street because then you're thinking oh 15 steps now I couldn't run down my street without stopping and walking for a little bit and so I did that for about 45 minutes so it was really good this is about like this is actually about a half an hour of cool down afterwards so I'm still nice and red and everything but um we'll see how my ankles and calves feel because that's one of the reasons why I don't like running on the uh, on outside it's my ankles hurt the ne next day my calves hurt but I mean it's like that good hurt my ankles just kind of hurt so we'll see how they feel tomorrow but you know I think it's this one of those things that I need to get over and they need to be strengthened so maybe I'll, I'll keep on trying to keep it going but definitely tomorrow I'm gonna wake up at uh, and get in the gym at 315 that way I can uh, do you know some cardio I mean my weight workout which I enjoy I need to now UMass Blue Angel mentioned this and I need to really get on this is um she said that she has pictures of people that she wants to look like I really need to get like posters of people that I would like to look at like in, like Arnold and you know I mean just people like that um you know there's one thing that I enjoy about uh Arnold's body is that despite how big he was he was really smooth like it's kind of hard to explain it, but I mean, like, when you look at, um, oh, goodness, I don't know, Jay Cutler, and I can't remember the guy that he beat for the life of me, the guy who's, uh, the black guy who's been, uh, I don't know, for so long, oh, well, the name escapes me, I want to say Ron, Ronald, right? something, um, now, they have a lot of, a lot of their veins are popping out and stuff, and I don't know, I just always enjoyed, like, the smoother muscular look, so we'll have to go for that. But, um, yeah, uh, things are going pretty good. I've got, I'm holding on to a 95% in my class, and, um, so that's really good. Uh, let's see, what else is going on? I don't know. Uh, life just keeps on kind of going on. Um, kind of doing my thing. Still single. Um, I really. Ronnie Coleman. There we go. Sorry. That I, I couldn't let it go. You know, without knowing that, because you know, I'll, I look up to a lot of these guys. Because you know what I mean. When I'm working out and everything, I'm like, okay. You know, I can go one more set, or, or I mean, not one more set, one more rep, and, you know, just push it, push it, and push it. You know, um, I'll be doing, like, curls, and then, you know, I'll be, like, lifting, and I can't really get it. And I sit down for a second, and I just say to myself, no, you can do it. And so, I just find an inner strength where I can at least pull, like, two more. So, you know, I, stuff like that. And so, I mean, a lot of people are, you know, my inspiration and everything like that. I really can't wait to start getting bigger again you know I when in July January I really liked the way that I looked and unfortunately I had kind of had to let it go for my class but you know I just realized that you know my career is important but myself is important too and I can always work out later but it's such a huge stress relief and it makes me so happy when I do it believe me like even my friends know when I'm not working out they're like man you're not in a very good mood I'm like yeah because I haven't been able to work out I love it uh so, um, but yeah, I, I thought this week has been a really good week so far, even though we're only Tuesday, I've really enjoyed it. I don't know, just that next day, you just have so much energy. It's, it's, uh, like, a in the Arnold Burke book, Modern Bodybuilding, what a encyclopedia, you know, you got to use energy to get new energy, you know, use the old and get new, and man, it just feels so good the next day. Um... 
so yeah. Oh man, I should, I should take a protein shake here. Um, so yeah, things are going good. Uh, school's going good. My brother's birthday's tomorrow. I don't think he watches these, but happy birthday if you do. Um, I'll give him a call tomorrow. Taxes are coming up. Can't wait for that. But yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So. I hope you all are doing well. I am watching you guys. Uh, you know, I try to comment here and there when I get a chance. Um, but, oh, 7707. I am looking at going there. I seriously am. Um, I know UMass Blue Angel is going there. I talked to Super Bastard about this, and he said that he may be able to if um, he may be able to. So, freaking it's pop-ups. Uh, Bankston said that he's not sure if he really can. So what I was going to talk to you guys about was, um, oh my goodness, these pop-ups are getting insane. Um, if, uh, you know, there are a lot of people in the group that I'm not sure where they, where they live or anything like that. Like I know SS Lucy girl is in Germany, so she obviously probably won't make it, but I mean, uh, like B Gump and Terry and Amp Gusto and you know uh, 85 Vet and you know I just want you know if you guys are in that area you're looking for going then I'd love to know um, also if it ends up that you guys can't or a lot of you can't I need to know that a lot of you guys are in southern uh, eastern like Florida and I know that Terry and B Gump live close to each other I think Ohio. I'm not good with geography, so. But um, if we want, uh, instead of going to 7707, because I'll be honest, the only people that I really care about meeting are the gut to gut guys, then we can just do one uh, instead of that. You know I mean, what I mean? We can do one in the southeastern. Um, but if we want to do something like that, uh, just let me know, because. Um, you know, I can take the time off work and save money by a plane, tr you know, plane ticket. And so, yeah, it'd be really great to finally meet you guys. Super Bastard and Bangstun, thank you for the uh, phone call. Uh, it, it was funny to hear you guys, so. Um, but yeah, this week I'm really hammering it out. I mean, it's like the moment that I have free time, I'm in the gym. You know, I'll sporadically, I'll go here and there and work out my chest and whatever, but it's not nearly what I want it to be, not nearly how happy I, you know, it makes me happy to get in the gym, and I just haven't had that energy and that happiness since I've been in the gym, so, but this week, I could already feel it today, you know, I went to the gym yesterday, this morning, I was just like, this, today, I was like, you know, it's good, so, anyways, uh, and my mom called me and said that I touch my face a lot when I'm in my videos, so, sorry, just a, uh, Thing that I do, I guess. Oh, 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 well, you probably wonder about this. This is gone because paramedic and clinical trials or ride alongs and all that stuff, and you know, you can't have a goatee, so I had to get rid of it. So maybe I'll grow it back. I don't know because when I get hired by the MT, it's going to be gone anyway. So I think I will grow it back out. That way I can enjoy it while I still can. So. Anyways, I hope to hear from you all soon. I am watching you guys, and hopefully, as soon as this class... Oh, uh, oh, freaking 101's almost over. I cannot believe that. Um, and you know what? I'm starting this week, but I'm going to do my best. Next one, to be a more active person in the group. Get to know you guys a lot more. And, uh, you know, I'm starting a little bit early. My diet's been kicking butt this week. Um, but, uh... You know, I'm going to try and be a more active person in the group this next go around because I really felt like I missed out on this time. I missed, missed out on meeting a lot of you guys, and, uh, you know, I'm sorry for that. So, um, I'll definitely do my best this next round to meet all of you guys and let you guys meet me. So, I hope you guys are all doing well, doing good on the diet, and I will hear from you soon. Bye.